What's up, Hacksplain followers? I'm super happy to come to the final challenge of the three star challenges today with the upload type challenge. And it tells us that we should upload a file that has no PDF or zip extension. And this falls under the improper input validation challenges. And if you were watching closely in the previous video that I've uploaded, in the upload size challenge, which I'm actually going to link in the top right corner, we are going to use the very same functionality. And this was if we scroll up to the bottom of the page and go to complaint, we can upload a file over here. And this file upload has some client side validation that only allows to upload PDF and zip files. So I'm going to select a PDF file and see how the upload looks like. So you can see the doc one PDF right over here. And I'm going to put down a message saying ASTF and I will submit this to the server. All right, so let's check in Burp Suite what we see. And we do see a post request going out to slash file upload. So let's send this to repeater by clicking on control R and resending this to the application. And we do see that we're getting a 204 no content response. So now the question is, how can we alter our request to send a file which is not allowed to be sent to the server? Well, if we look closely down below here, we can see the multi-part data entry right over here. And we see that a doc1 PDF file was sent with the content type set to application PDF. So I'm going to start by deleting the PDF file in the data section by actually selecting all the data first. And once I've reached the bottom of this page, I will mark the text until end of file, EUF, delete it, and I'm going to substitute it with the content of a JPEG file. And for that, I've prepared or opened up a JPEG file in Notepad. So if you haven't seen a JPEG file before opened in Notepad, rather than using an image viewer, this is how a JPEG file looks like. And I'm going to mark all that text right now, all the data, and put it right in here. Next up, I'm going to change the file name that we do see over here to doc1.jpg. And last but not least, I will also select the content type and change that from PDF to JPEG right over here. So let's send this to the server and see if this circumvents the client side controls. We do see that we got a 204 no content response. So let's check in OSP2 shop. And we see that we have successfully solved the challenge upload type, upload a file that has no PDF or zip extension. Perfect. All right. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe in the top right corner and have fun with all my other videos.